What's going on everybody? Feel like the squid here today. Just going a couple blocks. I didn't really feel like putting everything on, so t-shirt, no gloves. I got my my padded pants on. The the climb K2 or K1, whatever they called. I've been wearing them all day. I was gonna go for a ride earlier and kept them on. They're just comfortable. And with my legs still a little hurt it's actually uh nice to have the padding on the knee if i have to do anything uh working on anything where i'm kneeling or crawling or whatever and i usually always wear boots anyway so just top squidding it today other than the helmet I saw a video on uh, Reddit today of a, a guy didn't secure a mattress in his truck and it fell out, got caught up under the motorcycle's wheel and the guy, the guy riding the motorcycle did well. He, he kept it up, he didn't fall over or anything. And someone was saying something about motorcycles and doing something, I forget what the exact thing was. But I had mentioned that when a lot of people that ride, when we stop, we'll stop like this. We'll come up to like near the back to the side of the car so that if another car comes up behind us, uh, we don't get hit if they're not paying attention or whatever. I think it was something along the lines of them saying that uh, they're hoping that the car behind the motorcycle was paying enough attention not to still run into the guy. So I made the comment how we'll come up to the side and I say if... I'm in the road and a car comes up behind me, I'll, I'll go like this. I'll pull my brake light a couple times so that my brake light flashes and they'll pay attention and not hit me, just like an extra piece. <coughs> just, just an extra little, just an extra little thing of warning saying, hey, I'm here, don't hit me. Uh, I know most people will see me, uh, especially on this bike, how bright it is and, uh, it's a bike that the lights are always on and all that. So I'm not, I'm not too worried, but I also want to have a little bit of extra safety and security. So when I made the comment about me flashing my brake when somebody was coming up, somebody else responded, and he, it's, it's on the internet, so you can't really tell someone's emotion or anything, but he seemed a little upset that I said that. That I said that I flash my brake. That when I'm sitting there, if I see someone coming up, I'll flash my brake and say, like, hey, I'm here. And he felt the need to tell me that what I was doing was completely wrong. That there's no reason I should be stopped like this at a red light without having my brake pulled in. Or my foot up on the, on the back brake to uh, have my brake light on. And I, I could understand the idea of that, but if I'm at a red light and I'm on a motorcycle with the clutch in, why am I going to sit there with my brake light on? I mean, I'm just sitting there. I don't need to have all my hands doing something, and your hands are like the, the main part of control of your bike. The less I'm doing with them, the more control I have. And that's my thinking of it. So... <clears throat> That's pretty much what I just said, and he didn't really say anything back. And another person commented, and I doubt his was actually interesting to me, that he was taught in his uh, standard transmission car, one that uses a clutch, that if you are in neutral, say if I come up here and I'm in neutral, and I come up to this, and I technically don't have full control over the bike if I don't have the brake in, because... There's nothing keeping the bike from moving backwards uh, without me making it move backwards or forwards or whatever. Uh, if the bike is in gear, I'm physically making it go forward or if I'm pushing it back, blah, 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 whatever. So that was kind of interesting and I'd have to check the state laws around here to see if that is something. But that one was interesting the other guy just seemed kind of douchey about it saying why why is it so hard for you to be at a light and uh, not have your your brake light on 
then I don't know. Usually I'm sitting there like this. I'll have my finger over the brake because I usually do all the time. I might not have it on when I'm in neutral or whatever if I don't need to. I just thought it was kind of interesting. But let me know what you think about all of that. Uh, typically in traffic, I if it's not going to be a very super long light, I will stay in first gear just so that if something are to come up, if I hear tires screeching behind me, I have that extra second that I don't have to shift in the first to jump forward and try to get out of the way or whatever. And it just lets me have full control of the bike. But there's times where it's uh, just not not needed to be in gear the whole time that uh, you're doing something. Sometimes I just uh, sit there in neutral. I don't know. I'm, I'm rambling on at this point. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you disliked the video, give it a dislike. And if you did dislike it, please let me know why in the comments below so I can make this channel better for both you and me. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'll see you all next time.